This is the book of Romans, chapter 12 and verse 2. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind, that ye may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of the Most High. I want to start by giving all praises, honor, and glory unto the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, in the name of His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai, in the name of the Holy Spirit, the Rechakadash, the Bolanus to the Apostles, and the elders of the Great Mosul, for teaching truth and for ruling well, and peace, salutation to all you I came out there pushing and defending this gospel throughout the four corners of the earth, as well as to the believers, anyhow, by Hashem, the men as well as the women, the hopeful elect. This is the brother Kahana La from the GMS Hawaii. I wanted to do a quick <clears throat> impromptu, Lord willing, and be edifying. You know, um, inspired by, well, ultimately through the Spirit, you know, I heard somebody say, uh, uh, um, make, make a positive impact in the world. And truly, <clears throat> The only positive force that's out here in the planet Earth, man, is the men of the Lord. Everything else outside of of the congregation of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai is a negative force to the world, man. You know, a lot of people like to say they're making a positive impact in the world by collecting trash or you know helping out the animals or giving food to the homeless. And all that BS trying to what? Pretty much better the <clears throat> better the, the, the planet or better the, the their communities. And ultimately it's not gonna work, man, because at the end of the day, we're living under under a wicked rule under Esau Edom, man. And like the scriptures say, well as a uh, as the ruler of the people is or, or, or as the ruler of the uh, nation is roughly paraphrasing, so are the people. And Esau eat them from the top. They're all corrupt, man. You know, and this is why we see uh, corrupt politics, corrupt, you know, everything. Education systems, corrupt uh, music, corrupt everything, man. The corrupt mu uh, food, corrupt uh, medicine is all a corruption, man. And this is why Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai told us to <clears throat> to not, you know, conform with the world, to not be a part of this world. Yeah, we have to live in here and do, you know, what we got to do to to maintain. But it doesn't mean that we're out here to to better this place, man. You know, and 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 truly, like I was going into the the only positive energy that's out here is. You know, the men of the Lord preaching what? The, the downfall of this kingdom, man. Because that's the only thing. The only positive thing that can happen to this world, man, is <clears throat> for, for the rulership that's now to be destroyed and a righteous rulership uh, to be established, man. And this is all... This is why in the scriptures it says what? That... Um, Real quick, one that is profitable. <clears throat> Just bear with me, I can't. Baba Kusha. <clears throat> In the book of Ecclesiastes, it's 10 and verse 4. It says, The power of the earth is in the hand of the Lord, showing you that. You know, even Esau, Edom, the basis of man was established by the Heavenly Father, man, for, for, for a purpose. You know, I have created the wicked one. Well, I have I have created everything, uh, even the wicked one uh, for the day of evil, roughly paraphrasing, man. So the Lord created everything, good and evil, man, for its purpose. And the reason why he created these devils, man, is to show us the Israelites the, the, the consequences of not following after the law, statutes, and commandments, man. Following after wickedness. This is the consequence, man. Living in a, a fucked up world in every sense of it, man. You know? So, again, it says the power of the earth 
is in the hand of the Lord Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai, and in due time he will set <clears throat> over it one that is profitable, and that one that is profitable starts with our Lord and Savior Yahweh Shai, the King of King, Lord of Lords, and uh, you know uh, King David afterwards, which is going to be our our, our our fiscal king on the earth. And then the, the, the elect man Starting off with You know Again King David the, the twelve And all The rest of the prophets That's gonna be The That righteous rulership man That's gonna <clears throat> Bring true order True uh, harmony To chiefly to our kingdom To, to our people But also uh, To the heathens man it's going to be a, a, a righteous world, you know? So back here in uh, <clears throat> the book of Romans, let's start at the top, Romans 12 and verse 1. It says, I beseech you, <clears throat> and it says, dedicated service uh, or a living sacrifice to the, to, to the Most High. Which, you know, as I mentioned, people say, you know, make a positive impact to the world or be a positive force to the world. They're sacrificing their lives They're sacrificing their time Everything and effort <clears throat> To try so, to try and so-called better uh, Esau's kingdom man But it's all gonna be for naught Because at the end of the day You know Esau is gonna find a way If it's truly a righteous Or a, or a, a, a good cause That they're trying to You know Fight for it. Esau's gonna destroy it, man. He's gonna infiltrate it and destroy it from from the inside. And <clears throat> if not, he's gonna buy you out and then incorporate your your foundation or whatever it is that you're doing into one of his wicked corporations, man. See, as where the scriptures say, what um, uh, depart from her. <clears throat> <clears throat> for this is not your rest For she shall destroy you with a sword destruction man. So again from the top here in Romans 1 I mean 12 and 1 It says I beseech you brethren therefore I beseech you therefore brethren By the mercies of the Most High That ye present yourselves Or your body a living sacrifice Holy acceptable unto the Most High which is your reasonable service That's right And if you truly are <clears throat> About justice About righteousness About you know Living in a In a In a, in a better world Hey You gotta come to the Lord And I'm speaking to You know uh, You Israelites man These heathen nations They don't have it in them to, to truly do good man But there's Jakes out there That truly You know Have good intentions man But those intentions are, are misplaced That faith that you have in a better world A better tomorrow Is misplaced Because that effort should be put towards what? Towards uh, praising and honoring and glorying Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai, man in, in repentance So that we may receive that forgiveness And be established as kings and, and, and priests, man So that then in the kingdom We could do the righteous, you know the righteous acts Not just rehearse them But actually uh, Accomplish the righteous acts In perfection Which is what everybody's Searching for man <clears throat> It says uh, um, That you present your bodies A living sacrifice Holy acceptable unto the most high Which is your reasonable service And be not conformed To this world but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind That ye may prove what is that good And acceptable and perfect will of the Most High So ultimately if you really truly want to do good Hey, you got to follow after Yahweh Hashem Shah Because there is none good but the Heavenly Father, man You see everybody be like, oh, make a good or a positive impact in the world well, truly, the only good that is out here is within Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai, man. And this is why we, <clears throat> as servants of the Lord, we're out here, 
you know, making ourselves a living sacrifice, man, for ourselves, for, for the forgiveness of our sins, and for our nation, man, so that the Lord could establish our nation and we could have uh, peace. We can finally have peace and rest, you see? And that word conform, <clears throat> being not conformed, It's uh, the Greek word Siskematisau Siskematisau It says uh, To conform oneself I.e. one's mind and character To another's pattern Fashion oneself according to And what is it that, that this world wants you to Fashion yourself after after wickedness, man. To to uh, to conform oneself to the mind and character of who, of Esau, Edom, man, the wicked. You see, and that's why the Lord told us, be not conformed with this world. Don't think that this is gonna be your your place of rest, man. Don't think that somehow you're gonna, you know, uh, <clears throat> turn things for your life. Around and then everything is just gonna be good, and you're gonna be living like Esau and and uh, and the heathens, you know, just flowing in wealth. Like, no, nah, man. If if you leave any any of you brothers and sisters, if you leave this truth, if you leave the the tabernacle of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai, you're gonna find yourself in in, in serious trouble, man. Especially in the times that we coming into, you know. Yesterday we was doing uh, a lesson on the MOTB with the brothers, and uh, <clears throat> you know we was just going into how pretty much we we right there in the time of Jacob's trouble. You know my my rib, she work at a at a at a military place, and one of the one of these days, uh, she told me she was, you know, just go, going, going to the restroom, and um, and she heard these two uh, retired military guys, pretty much saying like, oh, oh, you know, we in World War Three, right? And one of them was like, yeah, I know, we already in it. Or the first guy was like, oh, you know, we're about to hit World War Three. And the other one was like, yeah, I know, we already in there, actually. And that one of the dudes was like, oh, yeah, you know us military people, we know we know more than, than we should. But pretty much showing you, like, man, we, <clears throat> we in that time, man. And, the you know, the, the servants of Esau know it. You know, the, the economists know it. Oh. <clears throat> And the whole the whole world, man, is get is is getting ready for for that time, you know. And it's gonna be a a, a a terrible situation with those of you that that don't repent of Israel, come back to the Lord, man. So <clears throat> again, be not conformed with with this world, man. Or show yourself a living sacrifice for the Most High. And, you know, ask for forgiveness, ask for mercy, man, because that's what we're going to need most in these days. You know, so, hey, the only positive positive uh, force or impact uh, that's going to be or that, that is coming forth to this world is is the preaching of Yahweh Hashem Yahushua's return, man, which is, is, not, is not good news to the average person, man. But to us, it's, it's you know... Hey, th that's our, that's gonna be our 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 goal, man. To to be part of 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 the deliverance, to be part of the you know taking of the kingdom, all that stuff, man. It's good news for us. The gospel, the good news is good news for for the believers, but not for the for the unbelievers, man. So with that, I hope the quick lesson was edifying. Lord willing, till next time. Hey, shalom.